We measure microbes in microns. A micron is a millionth of a metre. The bacteria that give you boils or a sore throat measure one micron. A sturdy hair is a hundred microns thick. Here's a close-up photo of some stained bacteria, each measuring one micron across. The size of the coronavirus particle is arrowed. Now, to appreciate just how small it really is, we're going to drop it onto a bacterium and see how many stretch across the cell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Viruses span one micron, the width of that bacterium. So how many bacteria reach across a polyester fibre from the mask? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, each fibre measures ten microns thick. And here is a fibre alongside a very fine human hair that's 50 microns across. One, two, three, four, five fit across the 50 micron hair. And how many hairs does it take to span a hole in the mask? One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, that's an elongated hole, so it's safer to say five. Five times 50 equals 250 microns, a quarter of a millimetre, which is the size of the hole. So we multiply 10 viruses on a bacterium, 10 bacteria on the width of a fibre, times 5 the width of the hair, multiplied by 5, and you can see that it takes a line of 2,500 coronaviruses side by side to reach across a single hole. In the size of a hole in this mask, you could pack 5 million coronaviruses. <laughs>